Hey Gemini's, welcome back to Sophia Monet Tarot. It's your girl Sophia Monet. I'm coming back to do your weekly readings. This is for Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Mars, and Jupiter. What is this? Whoa, Two of Cups. Just you know, I, before I even said anything, the way I started the reading, it's like your cards already wanted to jump, and I feel like that's been happening in Gemini readings recently. Just maybe for the, like the last two or three weeks. Your cards have been like flying out of my hand right at the very beginning. So we had the two of cups that just flipped out in reverse and also the two of swords. Okay, Gemini, what's going on here? Let's see. Whoa, ace of pentacles just flew out. Okay. Two of swords. There's some type of decision here that needs to be made. Okay. Some decision needs to be made on this connection, okay? Maybe there's a connection that's been lost or someone is getting over someone. Someone's made up their mind to transition or get over someone. Ooh, okay. It has been difficult, but I, I got this energy for Libra as well. So some of you could be dealing with the Libra or you may have that in your chart, okay? Okay. Let's get into a divine spirit, Holy Spirit. What's going on with Gemini's this week? Two of Cups reverse. Why is that reverse, please? Lib Libra's energy comes out. Some of you are dealing with a Libra, okay? Or you may have that strongly in your chart, okay? Your birth chart. Justice is here. The strength card, Leo, is here. Yeah, this has been difficult. Possibly with an earth sign, Capricorn towards Virgo, with the queen of pentacles something has been a struggle yeah you may have been feeling left out in the cold with the five of pentacles needing clarity or truth in some type of way with the ace of swords over this relationship four of wands someone has been very blocked or guarded with their emotions seven of wands with the king of cups could be a water sign for some of you Show me that energy. What's been difficult here in this connection? What? Oh, what's been difficult? King of Pentacles just shot out. Yeah, this relationship, this, this is a relationship here. Someone you've been dealing with for a long time. Something has been extremely difficult to release or to get over. Two of Swords. Show me that Two of Swords there. Oh, that's a lot. We have the Page of Swords, Seven of Cups, King of Wands, Page of Wands, Queen of Cups, Ten of Swords. You've been hurt by someone like one too many times. You see all them Ten Swords that have been stabbed into your emotions? King of, uh, Queen of Cups. I had already shown you the Queen of Cups or the King of Cups. Let me slow down. I already showed you the King of Cups in the deck that someone is being blocked emotionally. And that's why it's been very painful. Ten of Swords to the Queen of Cups. Something has very uh, been very painful with your emotions. You could have been dealing with someone who's just very immature. King of Wands, Page of Wands. Very immature here. Seven of Cups, someone uh, who's been a player. Keeping their options open. Page of Swords. There could have been something found out about this person. Three of Cups when the Nine of Cups. Someone just wants to have fun, wants to party, drink. Someone's been acting very single. They're not acting like they want this or that they want you. Show me this Ace of Pentacles for Gemini. Show me. Some of you are dealing with a fire sign. Seven of Swords is here. Three of Wands. Whoa. High Priestess with the Two of Wands. Use your intuition, Gemini. What is your gut telling you about this person? Something deceptive is happening here. Could be with someone at a distance with the Three of Wands or someone you've been waiting on. Something very deceptive is happening. Use your intuition. Could be a Pisces. High Priestess with the Two of Wands. 
if you decide to uh, move away from this person, meaning detach yourself from this person, don't let them know what you're up to or what you're doing. What is this person's intentions with Gemini? Ace of Swords, King of Swords, and the Temperance to keep you waiting, stuck, Hanging Man, Temperance, to keep you waiting, to wear a mask, King of Swords energy, masking the truth, keeping you held up. What is this? Whoa. It flipped kind of weird. That's a lot. Let me show you show you this upright. It ended up coming out. King of Cups with the Seven of Wands. Someone blocking their emotions. Like I said, this energy is back out. Nine of Cups, Three of Cups wanting to have fun. Knight of Swords with the Five of Cups. It's like they feel bad for what they're doing, but not really. Do you understand what I'm saying? Like, they may be like, you know what? I know I need to do right by Gemini. I know I need to tell Gemini the truth. But I'm going to just do me anyway. Uh-uh. That's, that's a lot of assholeism. Okay? If I can make up a word real quick. <clears throat> Show me Gemini's energy toward this person. Eight of Cups. Ten of Wands. Oh, it's difficult to walk away. The full energy. If you are walking away, it is extremely difficult. You feel overwhelmed and weighed down by the situation. But some of you are choosing to be happy. It's like, I want to be happy. I don't want to be stressed out. Ten of Wands. I don't want to feel weighed down by this person or this situation. Potential outcome between these two this week. Judgment is here. The Tower Kaboom, Scorpio. And Ten of Pentacles. <clears throat> While someone may make a final judgment call to move on uh, away from this relationship. Show me that tower. Eight of Wands. There's some type of movement here. Queen of Swords with you, possibly. Whoa, my card. Y'all, my card. Forgive me. Card falling apart. Five of Pentacles. If you were expecting to hear from this person, you may hear from them and then get ghosted all over again. Eight of Wands, it's like communication that comes in that you've been waiting on, right? You get the communication, Queen of Swords, and then Five of Pentacles. It's not what you thought. Some of you, you're going to realize that being by yourself is what's best. Nine of Pentacles, investing in yourself is what's going to make you happy. Ten of Cups. Ooh, that doesn't mean that that's easy to do. And that doesn't mean that it's going to happen overnight. Okay? Keep an open mind, you guys. Flirt. And we have past life relationship. Yeah, some of you have been dealing with this person for a while some of you may still want to give this person a chance. But if you do, realize that your your mind has to be well opened to what this person is bringing. Okay? I feel like I need to come to this deck. Anything that this person wants to say to Gemini at this time? What does this person want to say? The love you give to me is something I've never experienced before. So they may not know how to handle your type of love. I blamed you for my mistakes. I learned my lesson. I'm sorry. And my life is dark and lonely without you. Your love is light. It's a bit codependent. But for some of you... This person may have learned their lesson. They may have not. Some of you, this person will learn their lesson once you walk away from them. Okay? You are very much so in their energy. I see you. I feel you even when we're apart. They may think that they see you when they're out and about. They may see people who remind you of them. They may do a double take. Like, is that so-and-so? Is that Gemini? 
and it's not. <laughs> they may feel a bit haunted by you as well. Whoa, that was too many. Advice. Advice for Geminis. We have unlikely. Let's get one more. Advice for Geminis. Take action. Yeah. Some of you, I'm telling you, it could be very unlikely that this person has actually changed or has actually learned their lesson. They may be telling you this, but from what I see, this person is continuing to make you wait, have you on hold. And this person is going to reach out to you and you may think, okay, finally, they're talking to me, things are moving. And then all of a sudden, this person ghosts you. And it's not what you thought. So you're going to have to take action. Okay? Stop, stop waiting on this person to make a decision for you. You have to take the initiative to change, change the energy. Okay? Because I feel like this person, yeah, they're blaming you. It's your fault. You're the one who did it. You're, it's your fault. You're the one who, you know, you're the reason why this is the way it is. This person could be saying anything or could have said anything to you. So something is unlikely here that I feel like this person is not going to put in the work that you think. Okay. Alrighty, Geminis, that is your energy. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel, Sophia Monet Tarot. You guys, this is the last reading of 2023. I have enjoyed reading for you guys. It's been a pleasure all year long. We've been through ups and downs, highs and lows. So I hope you guys have really enjoyed your readings this year. And also, um, I wanted to say I'm, I will be out of town. So you are getting your readings a little bit earlier. Um, but I will be out of town. And um, celebrating with my family for the holidays. So you guys, <laughs> I'm, I'm trying to think of everything I need to say in a few seconds. So yeah, enjoy your Christmas, enjoy New Year's, and I'll see you in 2023. I can't talk. Have a great one. Bye.